crimson whispers, unveiling the cult's abyss. The moon hung low in the midnight sky as Special Agent David Crawford, a seasoned FBI investigator, found himself drawn into the ominous shadows of the remote town of Ravenscroft. Rumors of a mysterious cult, known as the Crimson Covenant, had reached the Bureau's ears, and Crawford was assigned to uncover the dark secrets that shrouded this clandestine group. Disguised as a local, Crawford began infiltrating the tight-knit community surrounding the cult. The townsfolk spoke in hushed tones of the Crimson Covenant's ancient rituals and their clandestine gatherings deep within the woods. Whispers of forbidden knowledge and an impending cataclysm echoed through the quiet streets. As Crawford delved deeper, he discovered that the cult's rituals were centered around an ancient, tattered tome, the Crimson Codex. Its pages contained eldritch symbols and incantations that seemed to transcend the boundaries of reality. Determined to unravel the truth, he pored over the cryptic text, deciphering the cult's plan to summon an otherworldly being, an elder god known as Xylothar, the Bringer of Abyss. Days turned into nights as Crawford pieced together the cult's dark agenda. The Crimson Covenant aimed to open a rift between dimensions, allowing Xylothar to breach the veil and unleash chaos upon the world. Fear gripped Crawford's heart as he realized the enormity of the impending catastrophe. Armed with this harrowing knowledge, Crawford tracked the cult to a secluded grove deep within the woods. There, beneath the twisted branches, he witnessed the cultists clad in crimson robes, their faces obscured by grotesque masks, chanting ancient incantations that reverberated through the trees. Desperation set in as Crawford raced against the clock to thwart the cult's apocalyptic summoning. The air thickened with an unnatural energy as he stealthily moved through the shadows, trying to disrupt the ritual before Xylothar could be unleashed upon the world. As Crawford neared the grove, the cult's chanting reached a fever pitch. The ground trembled beneath his feet, and a crimson-hued portal began to materialize. From the depths of the abyss, tendrils of darkness snaked through, revealing the indescribable form of Xylothar, an entity beyond mortal comprehension. Crawford's heart pounded in his chest as he watched in horror. The cultists, lost in ecstasy, welcomed the eldritch entity with outstretched arms, the air crackled with an otherworldly energy, and the very fabric of reality seemed to warp as Xylothar manifested, its presence casting a ghastly glow upon the faces of the enthralled cult. As Xylothar's arrival cast an unholy eclipse over the grove, Crawford knew he had failed to prevent the summoning. The Elder God's gaze fixed upon him, a maddening force that penetrated the depths of his sanity. In that moment, Crawford understood the insignificance of humanity in the face of cosmic horrors. With adrenaline coursing through his veins, Crawford turned and fled the grove, leaving the cultists to revel in their newfound communion with the eldritch being. The night air echoed with otherworldly laughter as the portal to the abyss sealed itself behind him. As dawn broke over Ravenscroft, Crawford staggered out of the woods, haunted by the cosmic malevolence he had witnessed town slept, unaware of the abyss that now lurked beneath the surface of their seemingly serene lives. The Crimson Covenant had succeeded, and Xylothar's dark influence loomed over the world, casting eternal shadows upon the dawn of a new day. Thank you for diving into the spine-chilling mysteries with chills unveiled. If you've enjoyed the eerie tales and creepy narratives that send shivers down your spine, Make sure to subscribe to our channel for more hair-raising content. Hit that notification bell so you never miss an unveiling of the unknown. Join the community of thrill seekers and let the darkness unfold. Subscribe now and let the nightmares continue.